Squishy Circuits uses conductive and insulating modeling dough to teach the basics of electricity in a fun and hands-on way. All of the colors conduct electricity, which means electricity can pass through them. Inside this container, we have four batteries, which is providing power for our squishy circuits. We'll turn it on. Electricity always flows in a circuit, which is like a circle. We call this an open right now because there's a hole or a gap in our circle. The electricity is trying to get from this side to this side, but there's no path. If we provide a path with a light, we've completed the circuit and the light turns on. We can demonstrate short circuits by pushing this together. Electricity always takes the path of least resistance. In this case, the electricity is going from this dough to this dough and completely bypassing that light. If we separate it, the light turns right back on. The white dough is an insulating dough, which means electricity cannot pass through it. If we put the white dough in between our two pieces of conductive dough, the light turns on because the electricity has to go around that layer of white. We can demonstrate polarity of LEDs, which means electricity can only go one way through them. If we push our LED in the other direction, it doesn't turn on because electricity always has to go one way through them. It's easy to just try both directions if it doesn't work the first time. Once we've mastered the basics of squishy circuits, we can get more advanced. For example, we can use beepers. We also have motors to add motion to your squishy circuits. And we can turn our Play-Doh into much more familiar shapes. For example, now we have a snail with light up eyes. And those are the basics of squishy circuits. What will you create? Check out our apps or our project guides online for suggestions or create your own.